First of all, it's raining, so please don't mind the background noise. Anyway, this is free gas delivery, and welcome to a tutorial on how to get The Walking Dead in New Frontier episode 1, 2, and 3 for free on PC. Now, to get started, click on the first link in the description below. They click Get Your Torrent for Windows to download your torrent. You need this program to download the game. After that, install the program, and it should look something like this. Now, click on the second link and click on the magnet link. Then this should pop up, so click on the dots over here if you want to change where to download the game and click OK to start the download. In case the second link doesn't work, there's a third link in the description, so click on it and it should download something at the bottom left of the screen if you're using Google Chrome. Then click on the downloaded file and your torrent should pop up. After your download is done, it should say settings, so right click on it and click stop. Then right click on it again and click open containing folder. Here if you have power ISO, just right click on it, go to power ISO, go to set number of drives and select one drive. Then right click on it again, go to power ISO and click mount. Then go to Drive E and you can install your game from here. In case you don't have Power ISO, just right click on it and click Extract to. Then it should spend about 5 minutes to extract the file. After it's done, there should be a new folder at the top, so go inside the folder. And as you can see, everything in here is the same as the one in Drive E, so you don't have to worry if you don't have Power ISO installed. Now just double click the setup file. Click here if you want to start the music, and click browse if you want to change where to install the game. Then click install. But since I've already installed the game, I'm just gonna close it. Anyway, after your installation is done, just click finish, run the game, and it should work fine. In case you've played the previous episodes and don't have your old save file here, just close the game, open up File Explorer, go to Document, Telltale Games, go to the folder that says Episode 2 and copy all of these files. Go back into the one that says Episode 3, delete all of these files. Then right click and click paste. Now run the game and you should have your old save files back. And here is episode 1, 2 and 3. As you can see the game works fine, so please give this video a like and leave a comment on what games you do next. Also don't forget to share this video and subscribe for more. Anyway thanks for watching and have a nice day.